Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and tonight's video is going to be about setting and modifying guidelines. I normally just would take a guideline out and get it toward the middle of the page, and then it says right up here, and I'd put it to 20, and that's the middle of my page, and I would go down here, and, and it, my bit is 28, so I could go negative 14. But if you needed to do a lot of them in something, so what you can do is you can bring it over, get it close, double click on it, and it's going to come up with this guideline docker. And you can set this one to 20, and you can add one. You could put it 10 and add one. You could put it at uh, 30 and add one. Now, see, I've got one right here, double line. Let's tell you what let's delete that one for a second so we can grab this one see we've got this one at 20 and we need to modify it because it's already there bring this one down about halfway and you got a negative 14 and add well I should back up here I should have modified that 14 negative negative 14 well we'll have to add it and we need to just delete that one. So when you need to change, you need to modify it. 14 modify. Well, negative 14 modify. But let's say you want one every four inches. So you could grab one of these and go four inches, add, eight inches, add, 12 inches, add, so you could you could do it the other way, but if you can stay in this docker and it actually tells you, you know which one you're at, and uh, it's pretty cool because you could move it around and you know go to 16 and modify it. Uh, a lot of people don't use guidelines, but if you're doing something special, like right now I'm creating a page of text, and I needed to be off the page a certain amount, and I have it locked to, you know. Uh, well, that ain't working. So you need to get your four-point handle. And I've got it snapping the guidelines, which it must have come off. Yep. Snap the guidelines, and then you could snap it, get your four-way cross, and it'll snap right there. So the next time you write a, you know, another part of the text and you're not writing them all together, you can have them off the page the same amount. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. And thank you for watching.